दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन सब्जेक्ट इज सॉल्ड एग्जाम्पल फंक्शन दिस क्वेश्चन वी हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यूज ऑफ वाई दैट सेटिसफाई दिस इक्वेशन द वैल्यूज ऑफ वाई दैट सेटिसफाई दिस इक्वेशन यू कैन सी इन दिस इक्वेशन देर आर टू वेरिएबल्स इन वॉल्ड एक्स एंड वाई एंड इक्वेशन इज वन सो वी कैन नॉट सिंपली स्टार्ट सॉल्विंग दिस इक्वेशन वन इक्वेशन इन टू वेरिएबल्स so so it might be a different question not solving a solving an equation so generally when we have one equations one equation and two variables involved then you can try for this thing because this most of the questions are based on uh, this uh, concept when we have one equation and two variables like uh, minimum of left hand side would be equal to max of right hand side right so so it means if the two have to be equal left hand side should be equal to the minimum value of it and right hand side should be equal to the maximum value of it because that's the only case when they can be equal or max of left hand side equal to min of right hand side so these are the only scenarios when the two can be equal and this means left hand side should be equal to its max value right hand side should be equal to its min value then that's the only case when they can be equal so so we basically get two equations from one equation left hand side for left hand side equal to the max of left hand side right hand side equal to min of right hand side so from one equation we get two equations same uh, we'll try here sin 2x you know sin 2x is a function with period pi period pi period 2 pi by 2 that is period pi so graph of sin x is like this principal cycle is like this graph of cos 2x is again period is pi so graph is like this and when we have to take the draw the mod of the both the graphs then it is flipping lower half into upper half flip lower half into upper half this is mod of sin 2x and this is mod of cos 2x now the sum of the two we have to add these two just to take an idea what will happen to the sum of these two you can see at x equal to 0 uh, mod sin x is 0 mod cos 2x is 1 so sum is 1 same here at x equal to pi by 2 sum is 1 because 1 is 0 other is 1 and this is the value when the two are equal and both are equal to 1 by root 2 right cos 2x 1 by root 2 sin 2x 1 by root 2 the sum is 2 root 2 2 2 2 by root 2 so it is root 2 and so between them the graph would be like this it, it is a continuous function passing through this point passing through this point so it, it will go up and then come down right and after that you can see it is repeat so graphically it's the same section so it's a periodic function with period pi by 2 because after pi by 2 it is repeating so by summing up their graphs we got idea that sin 2x uh, so left hand side lies between 1 and root 2 right and you know right hand side is sine sin y mod sin y is this sin y you know lies between minus 1 and 1 if you take mod of it it is between 0 and 1 right hand side lies between 0 and 1 now you see here if the two sides have to be equal for some values of x and y the only case is when left hand both left hand side equals equal to right hand side equals to 1 so we get two equations mod sin 2x plus mod cos 2x equal to 1 other is mod sin y equals to 1 and you know sin y sin sin e mod mod sin equals to 1 like this graph of mod sin right whether you say x or y so mod sin y varies uh, is equal to 1 at pi by 2 3 pi by 2 and in, in left hand side because interval given is minus 2 pi to 2 pi so in this interval sin y equals to plus minus 1 implies that y equals to plus minus pi by 2 and 3 pi by 2 so there are four values of y for which which will satisfy this equation so answer is 4